And still on the budget, Gemma, too, with this, you know, single parents are going to receive payments until their child turns 14. I want to ask you about this because here's what the PM had to say this morning. I know firsthand what it's like to grow up uh, with a single mum uh, doing it tough. And we want to make sure that the children of single parent families have the best opportunities in life. Now, the PM, Gemma, failed to mention that he was a minister mm. in the Gillard government yeah. when the payment was cut. The uh, sole parent payments is an area where we made a mistake. We essentially meant that some of the most vulnerable people uh, ended up with less income. A bit of pre-makeover elbow there, but... Wasn't it? That's vintage elbow. Isn't it? It's yeah. vintage, yes. Yeah. So, but, I mean, <laughs> this is the height of hypocrisy, isn't well, it? Well, it is. And I think this is... So, for context, I spent the weekend with a group of people who I would definitely describe as from all works of, walks of life. And people weren't talking about the voice to parliament. They weren't talking about many things other than cost of living. And interestingly... Politicians mm. who were no longer worthy of our trust. And this is a great example of it. Do they take the electorate for a bunch of mugs who don't remember these things? I mean, it, again, it's, 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 you've got a Labor government coming out going, spend, spend, stimulus, stimulus, tax, tax, tax. It's a, it's a broken record of the greatest hits of economic failure. Mm. That's what it is. Indeed, indeed.